Hi guys, Error Sounds here. Today I've got another good deck for you. Uh, this is the Summon Druid, and like a lot of decks, this one takes advantage of the Spiteful Summoner, and that works really well in Druid because one, you can ramp, so you can ramp your mana with Greedy Sprite, um, and also the Mire Keeper, so you can play this even earlier than turn six. But two, because it's got such a strong 10 mana spell, and that is Ultimate Infestation. So you only need one spell in this deck, and that is Ultimate Infestation. So you play Spiteful Summoner on six or earlier if you ramp, and then and then you summon a 10 cost minion with that, and then it's just too strong for your opponents to overcome most of the time. So I saw Trump playing this deck, and I think he, he was the first person that came up with it. But I've made a few changes, so there's also a Grand Archivist in the deck, and what this does is at the end of the turn it casts the Ultimate Infestation if it's in your deck. So the disadvantage to that is that um, it actually pulls it out of the deck and plays it, and two, it will um, cast it randomly, so you could hit your own face with the 5 damage, but uh, you will get the 5-5 five, five Golem and the Five armor, so it's never really that bad, and being able to play 8 mana for a 4-7 plus a 5-5, five, five, plus 5 armor, plus stealing 5 damage and drawing 5 cards. It's, uh, it can be really strong. So that's why it's in there. But Trump was playing with 2. I think it's probably best to only play with 1. The reason being, if you're playing with 2, and you're also playing with 2 Spiteful Summoners, that means there's 4 cards in your deck that rely on having um, this Ultimate Infestation in your deck, and there's only 2 of them. So quite often you will draw them before... Uh, you will draw your ultimate infestation in your hand before you get to play all four of those other cards. So that's why I didn't think it was worth putting two in. I also put a faceless manipulator in there, and that can work really well with this deck because if on turn six you pull out a 10 drop, on turn seven you can play your faceless manipulator and then copy your, your 10 drops. So it can be really strong. And, it, and I also thought it would work quite well against Warlocks if they're playing Carnivorous Cube. You play your faces manipulator on their cube and then you could get two of whatever they've eaten be it their doom guards or their void lords so um i put that in there i didn't really get much success out of it uh, one because i didn't play too many cube blocks but two um it didn't it wasn't very often when i had the 10 drop on the board and then i could play manipulator but uh, i still think it's quite a good card to have in there kelisef's also in the deck because it's a deck with only um two spells in it the rest of minions it makes sense to put prince keleseth in there and the bone mare and the corridor creeper can also be really strong bone mare being a good finisher so i had a lot of success with this deck and these are the stats here you can see i played 20 games 115 lost five with a win rate of 75 percent so it is a good strong deck it does rely on you trying to hold on to your spiteful summoner so a good opening hand is obviously prince keleseth but if you do get a spiteful summoner don't pass it over in your mulligan phase because you want to keep it so that you can play it on turn six when you wait later on in the game you have the risk of drawing ultimate infestation which does happen and it did happen to me a couple of times but also um, it allows your opponent to be in a better position to deal with your your 10 drop when you eventually do summon it okay guys i hope you enjoy the deck let me know in the comments what you think and please don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy the video and i'll see you in the next one I want to get Keller Sith. No. Alright, well, if it's Agro Druid, the chain gang is going to be really good. J Druid. Last time, it's going to take some time. Hmm. Oh, there's a summoner. Good. So I'll go my keeper summoner. Man, he's getting some value out of his jade still already. Yeah. Ok, 
Okay, well. If we get something strong out of this. I'll take the 10 10. We should be able to play Corridor Creeper next turn with the Scalebane or Malfurion. So he went for the Mana Crystals, which is interesting. So. Spreading Plague would kind of suck. I think if he, maybe he's got. Has he got a couple of swipes, maybe? I was hoping not to buff that one, to be honest. He's got Spreading Plague, yeah. Alright. I think I'll Malfurion this turn. game. Okay, so I can silence that, but it's pointless. It only stops three. Uh, I think the Chain Gang. Yeah, I wanted to play Malfurion. Uh, no, there's no... If I do Malfurion with the Poisonous, you can just kill him off too early. Easily. Now he's just going to swipe and this one's going to die too. I need it to land on these two. You've been useless so far, Scalebane. Useless. So he's drawing for his ultimate infestation or swipe. Okay. I can silence that. Silence the 3-6, kill the 5-1, then I can do 12-15 to his face. That's probably a good idea, actually. Oh, can you stop it, please? <laughs> He's definitely got swiped this time. 10 1 summer. Oh, he hasn't. That's what he's going for. What's wrong with all these taunts, Scale Range? Put a bit of a buff on my taunts. What? Oh, that's fine. I think we still win then. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we've got Kelisek as well. I can see. Anduin, the light shall bring victory. I must protect the wild.
แปลมาคิดจะสวยTwo bone mares in a row. Yeah. Oh, not trading is a mistake. If he's got um, Anduin, I get pretty screwed. You have been. Yeah. <laughs> okay, this will be pretty interesting against a Warlock. If it's cube lock. Ooh. Okay, so we've got one summoner. Unfortunately, we did draw this ultimate infestation. Uh, oh, it's a zoo as well. They will probably be favourite here, actually. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Unfortunately, he's just going to play Soulfire onto that. Oh, no, okay. Right, we are not favourites in this matchup anymore. Okay, Spellbreaker's good on that, though. <sighs> Seriously? Okay, I think I'll just silence that 5 1. Wow, I'm traded. I still think of silence the three two. Your magic shall not I can't afford to fall too far behind. Speak your peace. Oh, he's got another one. Alright, we should be able to play a corridor keep it creeper for free. But I don't think it's gonna be enough, I think. Uh, I think Malfurion will help. Alright, well we're getting some good stuff on the board.
No, why didn't you play that first? Oh, because he... Maybe he couldn't. Ugh. No, not on the... Actually, it doesn't matter too much. I would have preferred it on the port 2, though. Right, I need a good draw. Saranac Chain Gang would be nice. Ah! That is a horrific draw. I think we lose. Well, Ultimate Infestation actually gains his 5 armor, and I can get rid of something pretty big on his side. Why do you call? Okay, so we're still alive. Ooh, Bone Mare too. If a Bone Mare... No, Bone Mare's not great. So you can just trade that in. Actually, Bone Man, we take less damage. As long as he's not got Soul Fire. Amazing. That's really good. Hmm. That being a 6 6 isn't great. Another Bone Mare would be excellent. Has he got Soul Fire? No, he's got Soul Fire. Damn. Uh, Chain Gang would be good. Oh, no. Right. So we got up to 11, and he's got 10 on the board. A few in Kelseth. Oh, that's... So he hasn't got another Doom Guard, so he can kill us with Soulfire. Ah, oh, bye, man. And it keeps South Sea Captain against Hunter. They're usually very aggressive, so. <laughs> oh, we didn't want to draw patches, though. Do I kill that so we can't play Crackle and Razor more? I think so. Okay, that's nice. So either he didn't have Crackling Rays more, or he did and doesn't want to play it now. Let's give us a summoner a turn early. I think it's important just to kill his beasts. Because if I can keep him to a minimum and then I play my summoner, we pretty much win against the hunter. Like, the only really thing that they've got is. Um... Yes, he did have a race more. A deadly shot would be bad for us. Unfortunately, you can trade two in without killing that, but... Okay.
That's not the end of the world. Come on, Summoner, don't let us down. Now, we just got to hope he hasn't got Deadly Shot because... Oh, wow. Seriously? <laughs> Oops. Oh no. That's disgusting. That is disgusting. Okay, so I have to hear it about So, if he's got kill command, he goes face anyway. So, he's either got kill command or we, we survive. I was hoping for another taunt there. So, yeah, he's got kill command. So he's either got it, or he hasn't, he's trying to make us concede. Ooh. Oh, that's good. <laughs> that feels good to win games like that. <laughs> 